my heart is heavy. I've never had this kind of emotion for a longer time. This afternoon, I just watching a video. A warehouse packed with essential commodities, foods, items, made for Nigeria citizens, were discovered in a particular warehouse. Body written COVID-19 palliative foodstuff. Rice of different size. In domain, name it, was locked up by particular individual. Who do we offend? Why is it that the rich are getting richer and the poorer are getting poorer? And the report said that for hours, hungry men and women and youths have been going there taking food items for hours. And somebody packed this food item Why people are hungry. Why people are dying of starvation in a country well, we have resources. During the lockdown, the, the, the government told us that they have, they have spent billions of naira to provide food to Nigerian citizens. And it was discovered that these food items were given for, to a particular set of people. Who don't have conscience? Who don't have human feelings? And it was locked down, stuck, full stock, in a particular place. Who are you keeping this food for? Are you keeping it for your unborn generation? My heart is bleeding. I am, my heart is full of pain this afternoon after watching this video. Who do we offend as a nation? Why the rich are getting more richer and the poorer are getting more poorer? Nigeria leaders. What, is there any area we are offended with people? Remember the money you are looting is our money. It's not your money. That one set of people or some particular set of people, the, the people that knows Abraham as their father, they give you palliatives, they give you foods that could have been given to people. Do you know how many people that have died this period because of hunger? Ah, God, who do you offend? Who do we offend? The poor masses. Who don't have Abraham as a father? Where did our leaders, why have you sold their conscience? People were carrying food, putting leg inside canal. People are hungry. A hungry man is devil's workshop. After work, after school, there's no work. Had it been that our leaders that are looting these billions of naira are using this money to open industry, it could be a different thing. But they are using this money to put it into a foreign account. Why the masses are dying? If we kill us, if uh, after killing us with hunger, who will come and vote for you when you need that vote? Now, the youth are angry. Nigerians are angry. We are hungry. There is no job anywhere any longer. The foreign investors, the company that, our, that, our, that engage our people, 
before. Many of them have closed down. Many have relocated to, to neighboring countries where they have good policies, where they have friendly environments for their business. The few companies that is Nigeria are struggling to survive. Who do we offend? Nigerian masses. We have to hold our leaders. You have to tell us what you are using our money to do. I shed tears this afternoon when I saw what is going on. During the lockdown, the Minister of, of, of Humanitarian Affairs told us that I use 800 and something million naira to feed Nigeria's children while they are at home. Based on my funding and report, an intelligence report that I received, I received from, from all over the nation, nobody. I stand to be corrected. No children receive food. And I said, even when the minister said they are feeding children at home, I told the minister, I said, why are you feeding children at home? Give the money to their parents. Let them take care of their children. Today, the money was traced into somebody's account, private account. Nigeria masses need, to, need answer. We want to know how all these billions are being spent. My heart bleeds and tears were running out of my eyes. See how rich, how wretched, and how poor most of us Nigeria are. To eat is a problem. A country will have numerous minerals of resources, the best in the whole world. If our leaders manage what we have, when nobody will cry of, of food. What are we asking? The workers were asking for 30,000 naira minimum wage. The government said no, they cannot pay. Some states say they can pay. Some say they, don't, they can't pay. Some states that, that say they cannot pay. Some of them are buying SUVs for their judges. But you cannot pay 30,000 30, naira. Even at that, these people are paying 30,000 naira. They have children, children in school, in private, in secondary, in high institution with 30,000 naira. How do you think they can survive? Why our ministers are budgeting 100,000 millions to read newspaper? Who do you offend as a nation? The youth are everywhere now angry because they have been backslided. They have been put to the world for many years. The neighboring countries, all these African countries, they are mocking us. When we say we are hungry, they will be mocking us. They will laugh at us because we have resources. We have manpower. Our leaders, please lead us right. All these things that are happening is as a result of selfishness. How can somebody they give you a palliative of trailers of rice and other food items and you keep it in your house to do what with it? What are you doing with it at home? When people are hungry. God. May God deliver us. May God touch our leaders that they will know that we are human beings like them. We are not animals. The poor masses were not animals. Students have dropped out of school. 
Why? Because the parents cannot be able to pay house rent. I'm appealing to the youth that are protesting. Please, let's stop the protests and give the government a, a, a chance to correct the wrongs. I believe with, with this, it will help us to save damage of properties and also save life because every Nigerian life counts. <laughs>